Do you know which type of dinosaur survived the Cretaceous Paleogene extinction event? You don't know? Then don't worry because you will be learning it in this video. To understand dinosaurs, we need to travel back in time, around 230 million years ago. Dinosaurs were a diverse group of reptiles that roamed the Earth during what we call the Mesozoic Era. This era is divided into three periods, the Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous. Each period had its unique set of dinosaurs and environmental conditions. During the Triassic period, the first dinosaurs evolved from reptile ancestors. They were relatively small and not as dominant as they would become later. Some notable early dinosaurs include the Eoraptor and Coelophysis. As we enter the Jurassic period, dinosaurs began to diversify. This era saw the rise of iconic dinosaurs like the Brachiosaurus, Diplodocus, and the mighty Stegosaurus. The Jurassic period was characterized by lush forests and massive ferns that provided ample food for herbivorous dinosaurs. But it was during the Cretaceous period that dinosaurs reached their peak diversity and size. Gigantic herbivores such as the Triceratops and the Parasaurolophus roamed the land. Meanwhile, fearsome predators like the Tyrannosaurus rex and the Velociraptor ruled the food chain. Now, let's meet some of the most famous dinosaurs that once walked the Earth. First up, we have the mighty Tyrannosaurus rex, or T-rex for short. This enormous predator was one of the largest carnivorous dinosaurs, standing about 20 feet tall and reaching lengths of up to 40 feet. Its powerful jaws and sharp teeth made it a fearsome hunter. Next, we have the long-necked Brachiosaurus. This herbivorous giant was one of the tallest dinosaurs, towering at about 40 feet high. Another fascinating dinosaur is the Triceratops. With its three large horns and a bony frill on its head, it's easily recognizable. Triceratops were herbivores and used their horns for defense against predators. Let's not forget the Velociraptor. Contrary to its portrayal in movies, Velociraptors were much smaller than depicted. They were intelligent predators, using their sharp claws and agility to catch their prey. Last but not least, we have the Ankylosaurus. This armored herbivore was a true tank covered in bony plates and armed with a club-like tail. It was a defensive powerhouse, equipped to fend off even the most formidable predators. Personally, I really like the Ankylosaurus. What is your favorite dinosaurs? If you are enjoying the video, don't forget to subscribe. So, what happened to these incredible creatures? Why don't we have dinosaurs roaming the Earth today? Around 65 million years ago, a catastrophic event occurred that caused a mass extinction, known as the Cretaceous Paleogene Extinction Event. The theory is that a massive asteroid collided with the Earth. The impact generated shockwaves and intense heat, causing wildfires and releasing massive amounts of dust and debris into the atmosphere. The ecosystems changed, leading to the death of many species, including the dinosaurs. However, it's important to note that not all dinosaurs perished during this event. Some avian dinosaurs, which we now know as birds, managed to survive. These feathered dinosaurs evolved over time into the diverse bird species we see today. Let's go back into the present and learn about paleontology. Paleontologists are scientists that examine fossils to understand the secrets of dinosaurs and prehistoric life. Paleontologists explore various locations around the world, from deserts to remote mountains, in search of dinosaur fossils. Their work begins with excavation and collection of fossilized bones, teeth, tracks, and even traces of soft tissues. Once the fossils are collected, they are brought to laboratories where they go through examination and analysis. They can reconstruct the appearance of dinosaurs, and determine how they moved and interacted with their environment. One of the most exciting aspects of paleontology is the constant discovery of new dinosaur species. Every year, scientists discover new dinosaurs, expanding our knowledge and our understanding of these ancient creatures. And there you have it, you know a lot more about dinosaurs. 
If you found this video interesting, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content. Thanks for watching, and until next time, stay curious and keep exploring.